Well, today a NASA spacecraft is making a historic maneuver, landing on the surface of an asteroid hurtling through space. CBS 4's Chris Martinez tells us why scientists have big hopes for the small spacecraft and what it could bring home. It's a mission more than a decade in the making, one that could help answer some of NASA's biggest questions. We want to learn about the history of the solar system as a whole. Right now, a small spacecraft known as OSIRIS-REx is making a slow but daring plunge to the surface of an asteroid called Bennu. The spacecraft has been orbiting Bennu for nearly two years, studying its surface from afar and waiting for the perfect window to land. Once on the surface, in a mere 16 seconds, OSIRIS-REx will use a small robotic arm to collect samples of the asteroid, which will eventually return to Earth. Within days, we will know whether we were successful in getting that sample from that surface. At an estimated four and a half billion years old, scientists see Bennu as a window into the cosmic past. They believe it was once part of a much larger asteroid, and samples from the surface could offer a glimpse of how our universe formed. Did these rocks with these highly complex chemicals actually seed uh, our kind of system that now turn into the Earth full of life. OSIRIS-REx will remain with the asteroid for several months until Bennu makes its closest pass to Earth in March. That's when the spacecraft will launch a capsule of the asteroid samples back to Earth. It's expected to arrive September 2023. Chris Martinez, CBS News, Los Angeles. The asteroid Bennu is the smallest object ever to be orbited by a NASA spacecraft. Scientists say the OSIRIS-REx spacecraft is about the size of a small van. Wow.